I think this guy has something wrong with his base. But I'm not too sure. <laughs>
It takes three or four swipes from them to take out a level five archer. That's ridiculous. So we're going to go ahead and speed this up just a tiny bit. The king's now got into the center, the core that's left. And they just have that little opening down there at the bottom. The wizard towers are going down pretty fast. Just watch this last wizard tower that's alive. So we're going to smash through this wall here. And this last wizard tower, this isn't sped up, guys. Look how fast it goes down. Boom. What took that out? I have no idea what took that out. That went down so fast. It went down in one shot, but I'm not sure if it was just from the queen or whether it's from the archers, the queen and the king or just everything in general. But it literally just got smacked down so fast. It was ridiculous. So that was the second base. That was the worst base. Now we're going to go ahead and find a live raid. I've, once again, it's just going to be barbarians and archers. And I'm going to see how long it takes to find either a weird base like the first one, which offers you maybe loot and the town hall for free. Or a bad base, so something which is extremely rushed like this, maybe even a Town Hall 10 version. We're just going to see how long it takes and see how many people roughly have these bases in the game. Here we go, here we go. So this is a live raid and I've come across this. This was about the 7th uh, or 8th base that I was searching. And when I say this guy has literally level 1 nearly everything, level 1 wizard towers. I don't know what level that mortar is, but I'm pretty sure it's level 1. It's tiny, I can't even remember those mortars. He has like three of them. Are they three level one mortars? He has like level two or three archer towers. Level one or two cannons. I don't even know what level they are as well. Those cannons are tiny. Let's see how many troops this takes to kill this base. Now we've got those 60 uh, barbarians. We're going to use... How many barbarians should we use? We'll use, uh, we'll use half of the troops just to start with. And we'll see if we can take this base out just with half the troops. So we've got about 75 archers we can use. This is a ridiculously low base. This is so bad. I mean, people like this who rush these bases, they end up starting the game again because after they've done it, they realize that they're not getting any loot and it's just going to take so long to farm for the loot that they needed and they're going to lose it all at the same time because they don't have the defenses they need to hold the loot inside of the base. So we've got 100 troops left pretty much. I reckon this archer, the uh, archer queen, can pretty much hold off most of this base herself. But we're going to send in some more barbarians just as a distraction because she's going down there. We're going to send in the rest of the archers. Just clean up this base as fast as possible. This is going to be a guaranteed three star. I could guarantee you will get the three star here just for the simple fact that his troops are so bad. The archer queen's almost gone down. There she goes. Maybe we shouldn't have messed around. Are we actually going to get the three star here? challenge is on the challenge is on we've got quite a lot of troops left the uh the archers and the barbarians barbarians have gone down pretty fast to be honest we're gonna have to send in the clan castle see what we've got inside of there just some archers hopefully got some hog riders yep there they go that's pretty probably guaranteed us the three star there those hogs they are level two hogs i believe they're gonna take out the archer tower go onto the mortar they'll take that out for definite as well Look how much hit points they have against like these low level defenses that are attacking them. I mean, they're going to take like 10 zaps from these uh, Teslas. That Tesla went down so fast. Oh my god, these hogs are doing damage. There we go. They've taken quite a lot of the stuff out. Are we actually going to manage the three star though? I don't think we are. We're not going to get the three star here, guys. We're not even going to get the two star. See, that was my fault for trying to be smug, trying to only use half the troops to the base. But I mean, as you've seen, if I deployed all those troops at once, even one wall breaker just to break the wall, I would have been able to take this guy's base down so fast. This is just like a lesson to everyone, guys. Don't ever rush your base. Make sure you uh, ensure you max out your town hall as best as possible before moving on. Because if you're rushing your base, it's just going to kind of make it harder for you to defend your loot. And you're going to get a loot deduction as well when you're raiding. As ever, guys, if you enjoyed this video, please hit that like button below. Comment anything you want to see in the future. Subscribe if you haven't already for daily Clash of Clans videos. Share and favorite the video if you can, guys, to help the channel grow. Thank you for watching and have a lovely day.